a land like another enchanted amazing and mystic region culture tradition and cuisine one of the most sorted out destination in the world the god's own country kerala <laughs> But modernization fast setting in some of its cultures have started to fade away one among them being Kathakali. Kathakali is a theoretical tradition which dates back to 17th century and is currently the most important dance drama from Kerala. Popular belief is that Kathakali is emerged from Krishnanata. The dance drama on the life and activities of Lord Krishna created by Sri Manavedan Raja, the Samurin of Calicut. Once, Kotarakara Tamburan, the Raja of Kotarakara, who was attracted by Krishnanatam, requested the Samurin for the loan of a troupe of performance. Due to political rivalry between two Samurin did not allow this. So, Kotarakara Tamburan created another art form called Jamanatam, which was later transformed in Attakada. Krishnanatam was written in Sanskrit and Jamanatam was in Malayalam. By the end of 17th century, Attakada was presented to the world with the title Kathakali. Ignoring the first phase, when it was Ramanatam, Kathakali had its cradle in Vettatuna. Here, Vettatu Tamburan, Kotetu Tamburan and many dedicated artists like Chathu Panikar laid foundations for what is known as Kathakali right now. Their efforts were concentrated on the rituals, classical details and scriptural perfection. Kotetu Tamburan composed four great works Kirmi Ravadam, Bhagavadam, Nivada Kavacha Kalageyavadam and Kalyana Saugandikam. After this, the most important changes in Kadagali were brought about through the efforts of a single person, namely Kaplingat Narayan Nambudri. He was from the northern Kerala, but after basic instructions in various faculties of the art in Vettathu Kalari, he shifted to Travango. In the capital and many other centers, he found many willing to cooperate with him in bringing about the reformation performance. In Kadagari, Vesha's portraits archetypal characters and hence several hours are dedicated exclusively for the makeup of artists. The five major Vesha's in Kadagali are Kati, Knife, Pacha, Green, Tadi, Beard, Minuk, Radiant, and Kari, Black. The noble and divine appear in green. Kati represents the Agoran and Evil. Tadi have two types, Chuvanna Tadi and Bella Tadi. Chuvanna Tadi, Red Beard, denotes vicious characters. Bella Tadi, White stands for divinity. Kari personifies evil personalities. Kathakili has undergone lot of changes since in earlier and these changes are contributed by what we artists call Kalluva Chitta. This was introduced by Itti Yarisha Menon who was great Acharya. His disciple Ramuni Menon started his school which produced many great artists who became world famous later on. Kathakali dates back to 17th century originating from Ramanatam further stylished and adapted by many famous artists popularizing it not only all over India but also around the world. Kathakali music also uses Carnatic Ragas, Raga and Tela conforming to Bhava, Rasa and dance patterns Nritta and Natya. The orchestra 
which is also used in other traditional performing arts of Kerala, normally comprised of Chenda, Madhalam, Chengila, Ilathalam, Idekka, Shang. We took ideas from already existing dance forms, Krishnanatam and Prudiyatam, to bring changes to Kathakali. This art formerly known as Mukabhasha and Umagali. Kathakali has managed to make a mark not only in India but also abroad. Kalamandalam Padmanabhanaya was the father of Kathakali. There are so many famous Kathakali artists now in Kerala. Padmasri Kalamandalam Gobiyashan, Padmanabhanaya, Kalamandalam Krem Kuma, Chavara Parakuti Amma, etc. Then we can see a part from Kadigal literature. Ajita
such a padam is once again visualized by me this is the famous path taken from a performance called kushelavrutam written by murugannu shankaran koti this story is about the intimate friendship between kushelam and krishna